For over a decade, Norm Wells of BMW Motorrad and myself have been riding and exploring a variety of destinations all across North America. So what do you do when you've ridden North America from stem to stern? Well, besides bragging to your buddies, you conclude that there's really only one thing left to do. For a sacred piece of hallowed ground, or on a rainy weekend in August of 1969, a pivotal moment in popular music history took place. You realize that you're only stardust, you're golden, and it's definitely time to get back to the garden. Well, Norm, we've got a beautiful fall blustery day and we've just come over the bridge from Gananoque over the Thousand Islands and I thought, okay, let's pull over. We're right at the top of New York State. Let's talk about our ultimate ride this year. Yeah, definitely. And, uh, you know, we're going to try something a little different this time and uh, hit the Catskills area of New York. And, uh, you know, we've chosen some interesting product here to be doing this trip on. Took a couple of the, uh, the new Maxi scooters. This is the C650 GT Touring model and I uh, thought we'd have some fun with it. You know, it's fall colors and it's a nice relaxed pace on the big scooters and uh, let's just see where they take us. Yeah, well, normally we're doing this kind of ride on a GS or something of that nature, but you know, We've got the heated grips, the heated seats, <laughs> so we should be comfortable. And, uh, and as usual, we're kind of making this one up as we go along. You know, we've been pretty much all across Canada and we've also done some riding in the States. We've been down to the Blue Ridge Parkway and the Dragon's Tail. We've been down to the Grand Canyon and the canyons around California, but nobody really talks about this Catskills area. No, and, and you know, they do talk about like the other side, Vermont, Stowe and everything else. But this is kind of caught between the two because the Finger Lakes are just west of us as well. Right. So this is like this little unknown area, or unknown to us anyways, but we're going to bring it to the forefront after this next few days. Yeah, it, there's a lot of great history down here. You know, the, the heyday was the 40s, the 50s, and even into the early 60s. Um, a lot of vaudeville, the Borscht Belt, you know, the resorts here and a lot of the comedians and, and musicians that came out of this area. I think that's going to be interesting to explore. Um, but the ultimate destination is Bethel, New York. Now, tell us why we're going to Bethel. Well, Bethel is actually one of the areas that you pointed out right off the bat when we started talking about this because that's the site of uh, Woodstock. And uh, you being the musician you are, I know that that's going to ha have some uh, pull some heartstrings on you, I'm sure, when we get down there. Well, yeah, you know, <laughs> growing up uh, as a kid in the 60s, all I heard about was Woodstock, but I never got there, and uh, this is our one opportunity. So uh, I think what we'll do today is we'll, we'll head down 81 to Syracuse, uh, hit the ring road and then take 92 and 20 across and that'll pretty much put us right on top of the Catskills and then from there point well, and shoot. Head down that, that highway 8 looks pretty good so uh, start with that today and see where, uh, see, see where that takes us. Okay well it's going to be an interesting trip the weather's with us by the time we got to Woodstock <laughs> we were half a million strong. That was great. Yeah, the singing, not so much. <laughs>